I believed what uh, Nelson Mandela said that, uh, you know, everything is always impossible until someone does it. Then all of a sudden say, oh yeah, that could be possible. And this is why it's important that to tell this to our young people. You know, I think the secret to success, it doesn't matter if you come from a little village or from a big town. Uh, there's one thing that you have to do, and that is you have to first of all work your ass off. Uh, and number two, you have to have a very clear vision of where you want to go. You have to uh, be brave. You have to be tough. You have to have the discipline to follow through. Everyone has a problem with time. But the day is 24 hours and we sleep six. Now I know there's some out there that say, whoa, 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 I need eight. Well, I say just sleep a little faster because the bottom line is we have six hours of sleep, 24 hours are available, so you have 18 hours now available to your work, your family, your hobbies, and also to learn something new or to do something new, which could easily be that you want to learn a new language, or you say, I'm gonna go and reshape my body. So you're gonna go and take this hour out of your schedule and say, I'm gonna train an hour every day. So this is for most people a, hu a huge challenge, but it is totally doable, I can tell them, because the kind of things that I did when I came to this country, I mean, I went to school, I was working in construction, I was working out my five hours a day. I was taking acting classes from eight o'clock at night to 12 midnight. I was doing all of those things. I wanted to make sure that out of the 24 hours of the day, that I don't waste one single hour. Those hours were too precious. And so there I just want to tell people, don't give me this thing, I have a difficult time and with the time and I don't have time for this and I don't have that. You have time, you make the time. Wherever I go, people ask me all the time, what is the secret to success? Find your vision and follow it. You see, I think it's the most important thing that we have a very clear vision of where we go. A goal, where, where do we go? Because you can have the best ship in the world. You can have the best cruise liner, but if the captain does not know where to go, that ship will drift around the world and out there at sea and will never end up anywhere. And this is exactly the way it is in real life. If you don't have a goal, if you don't have a vision, you just drift around. You're not gonna be happy. The simple truth is, if you don't have a vision, if you don't have a goal, if you don't see your future laid out in front of you, you are just floating around without a purpose. Never ever think small. If you're going to accomplish anything, you have to think big. You have to go and shoot for the stars. The biggest challenge most people have is because they think small. And the reason why people think small and why they choose small little goals is because they're afraid to fail. They know that if you shoot for a big goal, then the chances of failing are very high. And they're afraid of failing. It's one of the most common things why people are frozen and why they can't make a move in life because they're scared of failing. I say to myself, hey, I'm not worried about failing because that's part of life. You're not gonna be, go and win everything. And how far can you fall? Look at this, this is the ground. That's as far as I can fall. And you know something? That the only time you really consider the failure is if you fall and you don't get up. So remember, never think small, think big. Work your ass off. Nobody ever stumbled upon success by accident. I mean, you never want to fail because you didn't work hard enough. I always believed no stone unturned. Work your butt off. That's what I always believed. No matter what you do, work, work, work. Just remember, you can climb that ladder of success with your hands in your pockets. You must work your ass off. It's that simple. Have a vision. Think big. Ignore the naysayers. Work your ass off and give back and change the world.